So I finally got the gimbal and it's a DG Osmo Mobile. So Harvey Normal. <laughs> so I received the package. I'm going to see how to activate it. I never had a gimbal before, so this is my first one. I'm gonna try and figure it out. But I researched it online a lot, so it's supposed to be really good. So we shall see. Ooh. Okay. There it is. So this one. Oh my gosh, look at that. Nice, nice, nice. So I have my phone here as well, so I can test it and see how it works. Nothing there. So these are just instructions and all. So we are going to be opening the gimbal. So there's like outer package over here. And we're gonna be opening it right now. <laughs> Okay, so there it is. It's Osmo Mobile 3 Combo. I ordered it because I researched a lot about it and it's supposed to be very good for the video shooting and also for photography. Fancy! Okay, so... Wow, that's really cool. Look at that. So it comes in in in, in like a pouch. And something else is here. What else is here? We're going to open this first to see. I don't know if it's supposed to be charged or not. It might be. So this, oh yeah, okay. So this one is for the tripod. Ah, so it's the same, the tripod that I have right now, the one I'm recording from. So that means that I can connect it also on the tripod, which is higher. So this one is smaller one, but it's really cool as well because you can position it. I'm not sure how, I think it's like this, or really flat or like that. We're gonna test it and we will see. So yeah, it's supposed to be, like, oh yeah, like that. <laughs> okay. And then I have something here as well. There's a string. And, oh, okay, so we also have a pouch. So we can also put it in the pouch or in the um, bag case so there's and there's something else is here I'm not sure what these stickers are it has four I am not sure what this is for but I'm going to figure out I'm gonna read an instruction and charger quite long actually so we have instructions in here Oh, you can't actually see anything on my table. <laughs> right, so here it is. So we have the case that I showed you and the rest of things. So there is instruction manual. I need to figure out what this thing is for. So let me see. I'm gonna move these away and scissors and everything. So there is like a stickers, but I don't see it here. I'm pretty sure that somewhere there will be says, I was thinking that maybe it's, it attaches here. I am not sure what these stickers are for. Right, we're gonna leave them for now and I'll figure out what these stickers are for. doesn't show anything in here there's nothing here so 
all these instructions before you begin. The following documents have been produced to help you safely operate. So yeah, installing the DG Mimo app. Search DG Mimo app. So I already have it. I already have the app. It's going to look like this. If you can see, perhaps, perhaps not. <laughs> so okay, so that's the app anyways. That is. And yeah, it's quite easy. I don't know what these are for yet, but we'll figure out. So let's open. Let's let me open the case. Ta -da! So here it is. I am not sure. I'm gonna be very gentle. Wow, Ooh, it's so cool. Okay, what's this for? That was just to place it. So here it is, and let's test it. So it has to be off. Actually, let me see. So it does turn on. So it seem like it has to be charged. But I'm going to turn it off because when you put the phone into the gimbal, it's supposed to be off. Phone camera direction. So we're going to be putting supposed this way. I think camera is supposed to be up. I'm not so sure. Oh yeah, so here it is. But it's if it's at a good level, I think. I'm not sure how to lock it. So it's quite even, it's already evenly set up. So we're going to turn it on. And I'm going to go into my app in DG Memo, and I'm going to connect this device to my phone. So let me put this. So here I connected my phone into the gimbal. Uh, I went into the DJ Osmo app. So there it is. You click on it and to start connecting device you press like a camera thingy. Oh yeah, you have to turn on Bluetooth before you do it. So we put the Bluetooth and we wait. So here it is. So we connect it. Connect and pair and see what happens. So you have to agree to terms and the conditions. Obtain Osmo device, yes. Next. So there's my account. Install phone, activate. So now we must wait. Not sure how it works. I never used this before. I have no idea. So here it is, Osmo Shield. We can skip that. It's already steady, look at that. It's already going steady. That is amazing. And notice left the beginning. Right until the phone remains balanced and released. Yeah. That seems like it's balanced. Hold till motor and move phone holder holder left and right. Uh, what's this? Hold tilt motor. Where's the tilt motor? I am not sure why it did that just now. Okay. Hold tilt motor and move phone holder left and right. What is it? Oh, okay, there it is, yeah. Right. So this is the joystick. I need to figure out how it works. Press one to take photo in here, okay. So these are just information that, that is here. And 
once you press done you are downloading through mobile network you're waiting to download like um, installation process or something and so excited <laughs> And yeah, the bottom, this is where you can connect your tripod, like a um, thingy, tripod thingy. But it also will be able to go onto my big tripod over there. So it's 86%. We'll wait a little bit more and then I will see how it records and everything. So it's really cool. It has a little pocket. Um, but the case is really good because it's comfortable to put in a case and carry with you. Now these ones, I'm not sure what that is, but I'll figure it out. So it's almost done. And now we wait until it installs and I will see how it works. phone camera yeah camera is supposed to go this way because there is a line that says the camera is supposed to go there so it's almost done so now that we heard the noise it's done we press done we press ok to allow it to go into camera so now it is in the camera I'm just going to play around with it so somehow. here is the gimbal and I'm going to figure out what it is. So here is the gimbal. I'm going to see how it works, what it does. So slide and select shooting mode. So if we go into the video, switch between front and rear cameras. So we're going to check out everything. Glamour effects, grid. Swipe and select the object you want to follow. So if you swipe and select, you will follow. And here it is. So it's really, really smooth. And let's see what happens. Okay, so that goes this way. It's like a joystick where you press. It moves it up and down. Left and right. Really, really smooth. Then we have a back button. I know if you press like twice, one, two, it brings you, okay, one, two, three, it brings to a video mode, one, two, three, it brings back to camera, there I am, <laughs> and then, I'm not sure what this is, haven't figured it out yet. There's video recording on the gimbal. I need to figure out how to... Okay, it keeps moving back. I know you can do it yourself. So there's take a photo. So that's photography here. Take a photo. And then you can even press like this. So you kind of have to play around with it. Play around with the settings and figure out what is what. So here it is, it rotates like that, <laughs> then it goes here, try press one time, nothing is happening, <laughs> nothing is happening, so let's press this, one, two, oh yeah, it brings you to the center, one, two, brings you to center, that's taking pictures, if you hold it down, nothing happens. Um, ooh. Osmo in standby mode, okay. So M is to turn it on. Ooh, fancy. So basically that's what it is. And then you just can play around with the settings in here. And you can figure out which way you want to shoot and everything. So I'm going to go and I'm going to play around with it. So I'm going to go outside and I'm going to play around with it and see how I can shoot and what I can do with it and yeah and then I can post some photos and do something interesting thank you for watching